I'm Pei Chua. I play Lieutenant Colonel Shen Yixuan in uh, When Duty Calls 2. And uh, I would say that she's a very calm and composed uh, officer um, who is all, always very um, steady when making difficult decisions and in difficult situations. And uh, I would say that she's someone who draws a very clear line between personal life and professional life. I'm quite similar to her in terms of drawing a clear line between the professional life and my social life because uh, like her, at work I'm very serious, I'm very focused and I need to deliver uh, to the best of my abilities but at the same time I'm also a very private person so when I'm off work I'm, I'm like a regular person, you know, I'm quite chill, very laid back as well. I have many emotional scenes with Desmond, so I still kind of dread doing emotional scenes because those scenes are very taxing and very emotionally draining. I do have a lot of them in WDC too. Unfortunately or fortunately, but um, I think these are scenes that you guys should be looking forward to as well. Definitely, because I think as a person you would have grown up um, a lot in five years. So, uh, Shen Yixuan has been promoted to Lieutenant Colonel, so I'm sure that in the aspects of work, she has been very competent and as a person, uh, I think she has been able to let go some of the emotional baggages and uh, prepare herself, getting ready to get married to Jun Guang. So oh, I think overall, she has matured a lot. Besides myself, Okay, I have two favourite characters in the show. I mean, I really like the coupleship of uh, Xiao Bai Chuan, Mei Guang and Tan Kim Po because in season one, they are such a humorous couple and they carry their humour and funny moments all the way to season two. I had the privilege of uh, chatting with a lot of uh, female officers um, and I realised that they have to train as hard as the guys. So that is really cool. Um, I mean, back in the days when I was a netball player, I would say that I'm pretty fit, but compared to them, I don't think I'm as fit as them. And uh, I really salute them for being the tough cookies that they are. I like the fact that there's a very strong family culture in RSN. And while they are away, they are still very rooted and down to earth and very much connected with their families on shore. Well, I'm very proud to be a Singaporean and, and I'm very grateful to the men and women who have sacrificed a lot to keep my home, our home, safe and secure. So please keep safe and healthy and uh, thank you very much.